and hello to all friends, potatoes are with you. Today, we continue to consider the map of the subscriber, who has made a lot of constructions of all kinds of mechanisms here, in the interests of which we have not really seen before. You haven't really sent me these yet, and I'm honestly surprised that only one person did it all. What else can each of you do? Of course I'm in shock. So really let's send, invent something else. It's very interesting. But before you start watching, be sure to subscribe, like, write a comment, and also just be sure to click on the bell, so as not to miss new daily videos. But we're getting started. So in the last part, we looked at this elevator, this elevator, then this drill, this thing. Of course, I'm in general in shock, to be honest, somehow it seems to be very simple. But I didn't even guess that it could be done like that. But it certainly works crookedly. In short, see what it is in the previous series. And also here, we have such a dash moving crane, on the basis of which we came up with the idea to make you know such an elevator that also moves horizontally. In short, let's look further. Here we have some kind of machine. I do not know what it is. There we have some, I do not know, water wheels. By the way, they are also the most effective. The subscriber is well done, he took into account our notes, and perhaps his own. Maybe he guessed it himself, since he built everything himself. Most likely, he even knew all this himself. In general, we have something interesting here, some kind of steam generators. Let's start with what it is in general. So, this is a gear assembler. To assemble, load the indesite alloy. To assemble the small gears, press the lever. And where are the gears made here? What kind of lever? I didn't understand, it seems to me, how here he mixed up the same book, because look, here we have a book that didn't match at all. That is, the bodice is quite complex with six commands and 28 logical elements, although it was over there. I do not know. Apparently, he mixed up the books a little. Let's try it. As I understand it, our water production is endless. Here we have a bucket poking. It pumps the whole thing out here, into the driver, and this driver pumps it here. This is our steam generator, consisting of a steel borning chamber, and also a shorter boiler. This boiler is filled with water, and somehow the whole thing heats up from below. By the way, how? I wanted to say that I don't remember how he eats. In general, it is powered by coal. So, here we have an overload for some reason. And why overload? Let's make the speed less, or do I have to turn myself? And she, oh my god. And what is it? So, very interesting. Along the way, we create something very. It's an energy booster of some kind. That is, you and I are twisting our hand, and it does not seem to go there on direct kinetic energy. But we are feeding a couple most likely. As far as I understand now, we are feeding steam, and this steam is already coming here, and making just wild energy. Maybe it is, but so far I don't know for sure. Here we have this overload thing. Yeah. It is transmitted here, it goes here, and we will go here. That is, we kind of help with our hand or something else to finish it. And it seems to be 128, there is a gain going on here. Here we have a clutch going on, to be honest. I do not know why the clutch is. We'll probably find out now. It also goes here, here, and in general, it feeds this gear and waits for it here. And why is he coming here? That is, we are strengthening here, to 128. Here we already have 256 it seems. But here we have 128 too. And for what? In other words, are we like, strengthening our energy with you? Let's take a look. So, how much do we have to put on glasses here at all? Definitely need to wear glasses. We are looking now, Opa at 64,000. And if we... And so it turns. <sighs> I figured it out along the way. Do you know what this is? It's us who have just kind of started the engine. That is, if we were now, well, let's stop this whole thing. In other words, we had a type of engine that needed to be started. That is, we ourselves are like doing so hop here, this is not enough. Hop, and like he's going deaf. And then, we clamp it like that, and it apparently starts completely. Come on, that's it, that's it. Look, this is really cool. I do not know how else to write it, like you figure out how it's done brilliantly. It's real like a real engine. It's true to work for a couple. But it's very easy for me to like the fact that, like in order to run it, you need to do something else here, like this, so this thing, twists something here. It's really cool. I don't know, I'm really excited. Listen, you can make a real car based on this. I don't know what to say anymore. So, the clutch. The clutch works by the way, that is, it apparently covers this thing now, so that we don't give us anything shorter here anymore. And here comes the one that reads as a comparator reads, the movement is visible here, and if there is one, then this whole thing is transmitted here. Here it is, by the way, we still remember, and this whole thing is apparently included here. Where's the transmitter? Listen, and I can't find, I can't find this transmitter, which is the receiver in fact, but here is the receiver. That is, here on the contrary, we have a type of clutch unclenching. It's really really cool. I think I got it right. I hope I got it right if that's the case. And if not, then by the way, make it so that as I understood it was. And if it is, then it's like very cool. I do not know. 
It seems to me there are also fans of subscribers, especially Kretovtsi. All Kretovtsi, it seems to me, are not fans of such things. I do not know what to call it, but the very fact of realism just struck me now. So let's go further. Here we have a tormentor of octopuses. Okay, actually, it's probably a farm. We have a kelp farm. So let's count it. Quite a complex elevator with six teams. What? Where did you get the elevators from? Like in short, you've lost weight, you've confused everything. But in fact, I'm not scolding anything. I'm still smart. I think I will understand something like that, and explain if there is something in me. And if they suddenly don't understand, then I think that there will certainly be some smart subscriber, who will describe the whole thing in the comments. In short, here we have, what is this by the way? What kind of material is this? This is fertile soil, and this is from farmer light. That is, we also get kelp, that grows more efficiently on fertile soil. That's interesting. On top of us, there is a huge valve that feeds it all. That's how everything turns here, works. A lot of kelp is extracted on three levels. Poor octopuses are also being killed, but in principle it's fine, and here we also have it transmitted, and look as many as three pieces. The redistribution is being melted down, as I understand it. So let's see what it is in general. Here we have fans that are powered. From what? They are powered by what? From something. That's from the water wheel. There are only 320. Well, by the way, from two. In general, we produce energy here. This is where we have a depot. Along the way, it's not at the depot here, it's all just fried on a tape like this. In principle, nothing either. And moreover, this is done from one side, two and also three sides. It's all being blown over, it's not being blown over from below yet, it could have been done by the way. And it's like you understand how effectively everything is fried, how fast everything is. Then it's all compiled here, as I understand it. Yes, he's coming here into this bowl. Here, with the help of these funnels, it's all pumped out, that is, the hop is pumped out from here, here we have only a laminar block. And a Soko laminar block is pumped in. Although there is no sense in principle here, there is no filter, you can even remove it. And by the way, I don't know why it is so elongated here either. In general, what do we have here? Oh, and, this is apparently a demonstration of how you can use it at all. That is, look here, we have just a sea of kelp stored. Let's see, there's 52 here now. Here it really just accumulates. 62 became, and apparently just this stove shows up well, how can you use this whole thing? In other words, it can be sent to the same generator, instead of coal. Exactly instead of coal, because we are running out of coal. And here we will not run out of anything, because our kelp is just ultra cool and ultra endless. And in principle, everything can generally be done with endless legal energy, and that will be so cool. By the way, have we stalled or something? Well, let's try to start it like this now specifically. Honestly, maybe I was wrong. I already think it means this, because there is no it, it is something in general specifically. Look at the capacity there is. And we ran out of just this thing here. All or yes. Yes, everything started up, great. By the way, I really like the fact that the handle itself turns here. Really very cool done. So, let's move on to the next one. What is this all about? Let's figure it out. There are three seconds, two seconds, it's probably some kind of variable signal feeder. Look here, here we have a block being put up, then removed. It's probably some kind of drain. I can already say, I can already say, that something is being pumped out here. These are coke ovens, coke ovens, yes. And apparently here, we have some kind of slag pumped out here. A block of the liquid itself is placed here. By the way, we can even use the key to see what is flowing there at all. So far, nothing is flowing along the way. In short, here we then have a block that just removes all the liquid, that is, it destroys it. Well done. In principle there is nothing to complain about. Okay, we have coke ovens here. There's an exit, an exit. Here we just have a transfer. And by the way, a book, let's read it. Coke oven, you throw coal into the chest in the center. Okay, so we take coal, as much as possible. Let's take it right like this, up 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 very much. It probably goes in that direction, and also on the sides. And here, apparently, there will be a result. That is, it is a block of coke coal, and also coke coal. By the way, as a block turns out, apparently from blocks of coke coal. Because here we do not have any such mixers, or rather compressors. In short, this coal, as I understand it, comes here and is being overcooked. Very cool automation. I like it because it's very similar. You know, that's how we played a long time ago, back in the year. So, in the 11th in Minecraft, who played I don't know who maybe even who was not in the world. Well, in short, then there was Industrial Craft, and Build Craft the most popular mods, and then we played. Just did such simple automations on pipes, it was very interesting. Matter was still firmly made then. By the way, it was much easier to play, but also much more interesting, by the way. Here. But now of course it's not that. Well, in short, I shared my senile experience with this kind of Minecraft game. In general, it reminds me of something here for some reason, though in brighter colors. What else can I say? Here, only we have charcoal, that's what is used in the minus. If there were a wood one, then it would be possible to automate everything, but now, alas, it will not work. But in principle, it's okay. Well, there was a potato with you, be sure to subscribe to the channel, 
put likes, write comments. Also just be sure to click on the bell so as not to miss new daily videos.